The Holy Father uses the example of a woman who once told him she had an abortion to preserve her figure as a warning against worshiping idols. Ho dovuto abortire perché eh, la mia figura è, è molto importante. The Holy Father cautions the faithful about the false hope that beauty, wealth and power can give. The Pope was speaking to pilgrims in the Vatican about the virtue of hope at his weekly audience. Elise Harris, Rome correspondent for our news partner, Catholic News Agency, joins us now. Elise, tell us about that dramatic example the Holy Father gave. You know, Pope Francis is really fiery in his audience today. He often uses stories to illustrate a point, and so he went off the cuff telling a story about how when he was in Buenos Aires, he heard a story about a woman who had had an abortion in order to keep her figure which he said is an attitude that's idolatrous and leads us away from Christ. Pope Francis also gave some reasons why we can be tempted to worship false idols. What were those? He said that those temptations can really arise when difficulties do. So when we face challenges and difficulties in life, we're tempted to find an easy fix that maybe offers a temporary solution. But in the end, trusting in God really means persevering in faith and in hope, even when it's difficult. How about the lure of money? I think that um, I read that he ended his audience by pointing out a, a real problem that people face. What was he, what was he saying for, that people should watch out for? You know, he warned the pilgrims that were in the audience against the people who try to charge them to get in. He pulled out a ticket and he actually pointed to it and said in, that in six languages on the ticket, it's written that it's free. Entrance is free so people can visit with the Pope and have a moment with him. So if anybody charges them or tries to, to get money from them to get into the audience, don't listen. Elise Harris, our Rome correspondent with the Catholic News Agency, thank you for giving us a wrap-up of the Pope's audience.